that one's that one's different. <laughs> It's a big oh cat! My oh my god! There's a bunch of cats in there. Genuinely not thinking that we were gonna catch anything. What's up guys, it's Yappy. Today we're gonna be doing something that we've never done before. We're gonna be bank line fishing for some giant catfish. And I'm gonna be teaming up with my buddy Brandon. Basically what he means by bank line fishing for catfish means like a homemade redneck fishing <laughs> kit. It's pretty much what he's explained to me. I really don't understand how it works, but it's got a lot of supplies he needs. So, <laughs> so we gotta go and get all the supplies that we need from Home Depot. If you so happen to catch a fish, which I highly doubt. <laughs> oh, you're betting against me. I don't understand why you're not, I don't understand the way you're fishing, but if Flair did it, it probably works. So <laughs> I'm excited. Let's head over to Home Depot, get what we need, and get this thing started. Just left Home Depot. We got the goodies hey. for the bank line fishing setup. Here's the boat that we're gonna be taking out, setting all the bank lines up on the river. I'm excited. I think we can catch some really, really big catfish, but we got a we got the PVC pipe. One of our buddies works over at PTAP in Columbus, yeah. Yeah. and he's gonna cut it up for us and make it right. I'm gonna be honest, I'm very excited. I've been in that shop all day. It's very hot. I'm excited yeah. to get on the water. And two, I'm excited to see why we need PVC pipes to fish. I'll show you. Tyler rigged us up with the most bougie bank line fishing setups. He cut a slit right here so that we could get the, so we could come all the way over. You have 360 degree rotation <laughs> with your god dang pendulum swing situation here, brother. And he also cut the back end so that it would go into the mud or the sand or wherever we're putting these things super easy. We're about to head down to the river. We also have another thing that we have to rig up and that's the actual line with all the hooks on them. And we gotta get bait. Oh, so. and we also gotta get one more thing. Uh, since this is Tristan's video, you know, the boat doesn't run on uh, air. So Tristan's gonna politely fill up the uh, gas tank for us. Thank you, T, I appreciate that. And uh, hopefully we get catfishing, you know? All right, here we go. <laughs> so we have an assembly line going right now. B's tying hooks right here. Got his braided line, his big hooks. For some reason, we chose one of the hottest days of the year. I think it's over Ain't 100. No weed, brother. <laughs> it's <You>. over 100 <laughs> degrees right now. I have my assembly line over here. Got my hooks, got my line. Kenzie's writing name, address on the tags to make us legal, but we got some work to do. I'm gonna rip a time lapse real quick. This is actually Brandon's idea. I didn't even think about it, so thanks, B. Here we go. All right, the hard part, or at least what we thought was the hard part, <laughs> is over. We have all our hooks right there that we're gonna be attaching to the line. We have all the PVC with names and tags and carabiners right there, and we ended up using bottles to wrap all the extra line in so it doesn't get tangled. We have our dead shiners right there. Duct tape just in case, but here is the weight that we're gonna be attaching to the very end of the line. But. Now all there's left to do is get in the boat, rip to the spot where we want to put the six lines. I'm freaking excited. I've never done this. And I want to thank Flair for inspiring me to do this. I wouldn't have ever thought to do this without him. So uh, shout out to my boy, Beefcake. But now I'm about to back the boat in, drop it in, and we're going to go head to those key spots. So T's dropping us in the water right now. He's rushing. We still got a lot to do. We're actually going to rig everything up as we get to each spot where he wants to drop one of these poles. I'm not even sure what this type of fishing is called. He said it earlier, but I already forgot. I don't know. He's inspired by Flair. So Flair, if you're watching this, thanks for making my day a lot harder hanging out with this kid. When I was with Tyler at PTAP where we cut all these up, I was working all day on my truck and looks like the truck is performing flawlessly right now, which is good. But Tristan's driving it, so it'll probably break soon. Oh my God. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm on hook, so just be nice and easy, T. Come on, brother. How y'all doing? Catch All right. Now to go catch some big old kitty cats. Meow. I am out of shape, but we're on the boat. B's got some crazy technology on this boat with live scope. We could really go and find the catfish first and then put it in. Too easy, bro. Too easy. Too easy. Let's give ourselves some struggle. <laughs> and you just basically point at the bank where you want to go, and I'll pull up there, and you just go stand a little stick in the ground. We'll figure it out. All right. Where do you want to rip to first? I said we go, go to the. Let's bit? go to the tugboat. Okay. So this this spot, if you stay tuned to the channel, has been like a really really cool spot where we go and jump off, do survival challenges and stuff like that. But we're going to hopefully catch some big old kitty cats. Um, we're going to be targeting flathead catfish, channel cats, really anything that bites, but. I really want to catch a big flathead catfish, so 
or blue or channel cat, whatever it's called. So we're gonna rip over there and put out our first line. This is so freaking sick. I'm so glad Brandon brought his boat. Woo. All right. Hopefully it's not too big of a struggle, but. I'm gonna be honest with you, T. There's rocks and stuff over there. You wanna set these pipes in so heavy because you're putting a lot of hooks on them and these catfish are not small. So I would say get into the sand yeah. instead of the rock side. Plus this is the side people can get to. Yeah. This side, if people are over there, they're Alabama wilderness people, you know? Yeah. They need the catfish. Pulling up to the first very spot, right across from the old tugboat. We'll stick her in, give her old dangle. It's a couple feet off, let's get a hook in. Let's get bait on, drop it, you yeah. know what I'm saying? All right, Ooh. bait number one. One dead shiner. We've got that. All right, now I'm gonna... Good. Here we go. All right. That's cool. All right, I'm gonna set a waypoint, T. All right. First line's in the water. I don't know if that was the best way, but it works, hopefully. First line is set. It looks pretty good. Let me show you real fast. Like I said before, we got the tag right there. We got the carabiner right here locked in and the pole. I don't think, I don't think she's going nowhere. Even if it, a big old catfish gets on, hopefully. Hey, I got good news for you, brother. What? I just set a waypoint yeah. and I got six of them. It's a fish symbol. It's fish number one. So oh, I have that's fish it. number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, number six. So that's it. let's go ahead and set fish number two. Yeah. Oh. It's hooked on something right now. I mean like not a fish. Not a fish. I'm gonna go mark this way. Oh. Ow. Hopefully she doesn't rise any more than that. All right, we got the line as it's set. set. Yep. B has the waypoint set, we got the line. We're gonna drag it out. We're gonna drag it out. I, hell, we'll just let it float us. I'm gonna get it over it. There's a stump right there in the water. I'm gonna get it over that and then drop it. She's set. Rip let's down run, a little bit. Let's run a little bit. All right, we're gonna rip downstream a little bit and set. We got three more. Hopefully we'll be able to get it in time before it gets too dark. Ready? Uh, probably this? high quality contamination right here. That doesn't look good. If I was a catfish eating some nasty like they do. <laughs> yeah. I'd probably be I'd right probably here. Be right just, here right? I'd probably just sit there with my mouth open if Ooh. I was a catfish. So look at that. So not sure what that is. I like it though. Drop a comment what you think that is. I like it's it. a big sewer thing coming up. Or... A lot of pollution here. It's perfect for catfish. <laughs> it's a prime catfish spot. Look at the jigging boat over there, man. Sexual. Just Sitting freaking sick. You want sits. an interesting fact though? What? Uh, the water changes volume so much that there's actually a bag in that tree. Yeah. That did not get there by someone throwing a bag up. That was the water picking it up and dragging trash through the trees. That's how high the water gets. So hopefully in the next 12 hours, Tristan's uh, poles are not 30 foot underwater. We might be diving for them. You might be diving for them. <laughs> Uh -huh. Now that is cool looking. <laughs> that is freaking cool. Look at that line. Let me move from the line. That is three? Four. Four? Four. Four? Oh, sorry, dude. Did you just <laughs> Did I hit the camera? <laughs> oh my gosh. So in all these spots, this one's a little bit different. We're sitting on a big drop off. It goes from three feet to literally 10 to 20. I don't even know, but. The Deep, deep, getting pretty, uh, what is it called? Repetitive. Jeez. But, uh, B's already setting, B's already, <laughs> B's already setting anchor points. All we gotta do is put the hooks on and the line. <laughs> Hammering in the very last stake. All these fishies. Hopefully we catch a big catfish. Look at this though, this is the coolest part, is setting these lines out. Look at that. Oh, she's going down. Woo. Boom! Lines are all out. All we gotta do is wait. We're gonna have a little bit of fun. Wait in the morning. Wake up as early as we can. Get out here and hopefully 
We got some fat girls on the line, so. Time to crack a bull. Crack. There you go. Cheers, bull. Cheers, bull. Mm. Let's rally home to the rapids. Mm. All right, it is day two. We're going to check our first lines. I'm a little nervous because I'm just hoping that there is a big old catfish on at least one of these lines. We have six lines put out, but hopefully there's at least one fish. B, what are you thinking right now? I think the first one is gonna tell us almost everything we need to know. So the first one's gonna be pretty crucial. I mean, if it's loaded, we can expect all of them are probably loaded. But if it's just like bait still on it, yeah. it's not a good idea, you know? I will say last night, I was thinking about this a little more. We might have an unexpected issue. Potential turtles. Oh no. Hopefully we're able to, if there is a turtle on the line, hopefully we'll be able to release them. We do not want to catch any turtles. I like turtles, so. Babe, what are you thinking? You thinking big I old catfish? A, I had a dream last night that there were fish on it. You did? I did. You yeah. have weird dreams. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna rip to the waypoint number one. That'll be the first line. Check that and hopefully we got a big old fish. There's the first pole right there. What do you think? So your line is not going straight out anymore. It's kind of to the right, so it could be a couple things. Uh-oh. What's that floating by? That turtle? All right, we're going to go over, gonna... check it out. All right, hold on, baby. Wait, no peeing while we're doing. <laughs> oh, no. No, it's this turtle. First line. I think we got a turtle. Oh, yeah. man. But it does look like you're able to get that out. I mean, it's not the end of the world. All right, he's hooked in the corner of his mouth. We're gonna try our best to get that out. The good news is he didn't choke it. Feel bad for the old turtle. <laughs> turtle. <laughs> I didn't even say it like that. But we got the hook out. We're gonna let him go. See you later, guy. Watch out for all the other lines. There he goes. It's a whole boat of oh. <laughs> <laughs> She got on on the deep side. Huh? All right, praying for a big catfish next, but. Well. Hey, the good news is, is didn't we didn't go home empty-handed. Right, and the lines were still in the water. No, nothing oh was God. left out. You know, Could I you was imagine? worried about the water levels going up and down. So thankfully, our lines were positioned perfectly to be able to, if we caught a catfish or a turtle, it would stay in the water, so. That was spot number one, headed to. Spot number two. Spot number two. Babe, hey, what'd you think? You feel bad for the turtle? Yeah, I feel really bad for the turtle. Yeah, I do too, but. At least we got the hook out. He's good. He's on his way to go and buy somebody else's line. I see number two. Actually two and three. I forgot we put two poles here. So this is going to be an exciting little stop right here, man. What do you think? I don't know. That one's washed up over this way. All right, let's go look at him. Oh, oh, oh no. Hold on. No bait? No bait. No nothing. Dude, maybe that turtle literally started from the <laughs> bottom. Started from the bottom. Eliminate every single shiner you had Dang all the way to the it, top. Man. Let's just leave this and check the next one. All right, number two, nothing. This is not looking good, dude. I like the way this line looks. It's deeper in the water. It's tight. It is tight. Oh, say less. Deep and tight are always two <laughs> key items. <laughs> Dang it, man. No. Oh, what you got the it. Heck? You got it, bro. You got a log, baby. Oh my gosh. Line number three. We got a log. I call that a tree pounder. Dude, I'm worried. We are halfway done. And I'm getting a little worried. We only have three more poles to check, so. Maybe we should have used different bait, different options for the old fish. We do have one turtle, so I guess it's negative one point, so. Woo! I don't see which way this line's going. Oh, it's moving. No. It's moving. Yeah, it's it is. Moving. It is, it is, it is. Oh. What do you want me? I'm gonna go pull. go that way. Go that Whoa. way. Oh wow! Oh, it it's is moving, baby. It's moving. It's moving. What do you think? I don't know. I'm hoping big catfish. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. There it goes. There it goes. Got something? Another turtle. Oh. No. Oh no. Oh. oh man. But it's not. It could be. It could be something else. There still oh. could be something else. The rest of the hooks are cleaned up, man. This was our extra long one too. That gum it, man. We only have two more lines to check. We gotta get this. I will this. say, I was very confident in this spot. Very confident in this spot. All right, let me work on this guy. Goodness. Poor T is turning to turtle man. To be fair, it's not what you're going after. You didn't set shiners and stuff out to go after turtles. This is actually, you would think it's better than nothing, but actually this is worse than nothing. <laughs> turtle number two. This is worse than nothing. Yeah, I mean. You'd rather catch nothing. 
Yeah, I really, I honestly feel bad, but maybe he prepped us for the shake and pole. <laughs> so when we go to our last year, I polls, was excited, dude. I dude, thought the, that was the it. line was in the water and freaking tighten up and go down. I was like, ah, oh. poor guy. Feel bad for how long he had that hook in, but we're you gonna did, let him go. He did get a free meal, so yeah. He probably got, he ate the whole line, and that last one he got, he <laughs> got two. It was the been, first hook. Yeah, yeah, they've been caught on the first one, and all the rest of the bait's gone. Yeah, they so. start. Ooh, a piece He's of like, fish. Ooh, oh. a piece of fish. He's Ooh. like, oh, this fish is so good. Ah. <laughs> yeah, Dang it, man. Two more lines. People in the comments, what do you think? You think we are going to... I double baited the last two lines. So I put double the shiners on each one. You're going to catch two turtles on one hook. <laughs> oh, no. You got me worried, man. <laughs> it's not great. This is not good. It's not great. All we can do is pack it up, head down river, and hopefully those two lines work. I don't know. That one to the right was the long one, dude. That one, that's the longest one we got. Oh, it's this way. It's this way, but it's also moving. Dang dude, it, that's, dude. I, that's I, moving, though. I you, know. you got PTSD now. You can't even enjoy when your pole's shaking. Yeah. That sounds weird. <laughs> that sounds weird. <laughs> I'm worried, man. I mean, your track record's not the best, but... And this one's moving, too, so... I think they both are... Oh, that one's, that one's different. That's a fish. That's a fish. No, it, went, it bumped hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 that was not a turtle bump, dude. That's a fish. Oh my god, I see it! It's oh, a freaking catfish! It's a big old catfish! Yeah! Yeah! It's a big old catfish! Oh, yeah, man! Yeah. Come on, come on, get him! Yes, baby! Don't lose him right here! Oh, oh my god! We did it! We did it! There's another one! Oh, 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 Thank you, Lord. You did it, yes, it, baby. Oh my gosh. Let's go check this other this other one. These guys are coming home with us. Let's okay. check that one. Dude, if we doubled up on I both, saw, I saw that thing going boom, boom, boom. All right, do you think this one? This one's going yes, crazy, yes. too. Come on. Hurry. <laughs> Woo. All right. This is the really long one, T. Okay. Be careful. Watch the hooks. Watch the hooks. Is it thumping good? Yeah, it's thumping pretty good. He's oh. moving. Oh, oh, it's a cat. It's a big oh cat. Oh my god. It's a, oh, it's two. Oh, we it's got two. two, baby. It was the double up. Oh. It was the double shiner. Yes. Ow, the watch the hooks. Watch the hooks. Bro, that's five cat fish. Yes. Dude, imagine if we set them up all right here. Yes. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, that guy's going to come off. That guy's going to come off. He's just, he's All right, we down. only need like two of these guys. Oh. He's hooked in the dick. There's sand in my mouth. Oh. Wait, you don't want to keep them all? No. Let's let's take them to the catfish room then. Downtown. Oh, oh, we could. Yeah. Obviously, I don't think T was Whoa! expecting to catch five. <laughs> Look at that. That's a freaking big boy. That's awesome. So we could throw them in the live well. I'll get the live well running on the boat. We're probably only going to keep one or two. But there's actual. Watch out! No! 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 <laughs> oh, he's got spots. There's. Cat fishermen down in Columbus, Georgia, and these guys are legit. They're there every single day, and they're not there for the sport of it. They're there to actually get food for their families. They bring these things home. So when you have an event like this, where you got surplus dude, catfish, those guys. Dude, it was the double freaking shiners. Dude, you crushed it. Oh my the God. Way the way the turtle pulled the line it in was the just pole like this. Slow. Mm, mm. The catfish was like, all right, get that live well running. Let's go. All right. In there. All right. Oh my gosh! Look how pretty. Oh, this is freaking awesome. We did it, baby. Big, pretty catfish. We're gonna take some of these to the fishermen, like Brandon said. I'm sure it's gonna make their day. Oh, watch out! One got away. I knew that wasn't gonna be smart. One got away. No. Yeah. You suck. <laughs> <laughs> that was freaking awesome, dude. He's ready to rock. All right, first cat going in, baby. Dude, live well's perfect. They yeah. Fit. Perfect. Right? Yeah. I don't know about that big one down there, dude. <laughs> dude this is Who are crazy. you? <laughs> I was so worried, bro. I was I was genuinely not thinking that we were gonna catch anything because of the turtle situation. This time there was no turtles, only catfish. Dude, best for last too. I was so worried. All right, let's get these guys in the live well. 
Well, we got her filling up, but we grabbed one by the tail. <laughs> oh, there's a bunch of cats in there. Look at this. That's what you don't want, that monster fin. Look at that guy. Monster. All right, let's go give them to some fishermen. We caught some big catfish. I was going to see if you wanted them. Yeah? We're, can you meet me down at the stairs? I'll come over there to you a little bit. Got him, got him lift up, brother. All right, here we go. I think I might have him. And I think our boat is secure. Hey, you're gonna have to tell your wife you crushed it today. Man. Oh, you already got some in oh, there. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, Good. nice, man. Hey, what do you yeah. think about these size, man? Is this a pretty good size here? Man, yeah. <laughs> I don't believe in throwing them back. You yeah. Know, I believe in sharing with them. That's oh, awesome, man. Know. Well, sure we got you some big ones. That's right. awesome, man. He actually caught these bank line fishing. Thank right? you. Yeah. That's nice. Right. What's your name, man? Sanford. Sanford. Yep. Started Tristan. my new job a couple of months ago. Oh, okay. And I'm off on Friday. Hey! Hey, hey man. man. Nice. Hey, that's awesome. all right, man. Well, congrats. Right. You right. enjoy it. Have fun right. out here. Right. It's nice right. to meet you. You're crushing I'm it, buddy. I'm going to take these to the house and put some ice to it and get some ice. Okay. Yeah. 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 Then I'm going to drop them off and cut them back. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's all she wrote. We got yeah. the catfish to a cat fisherman. He's taking them home right now to an old lady. Slitty. The perfect guy. Yeah. He said he got a new job. He's off on Fridays and he's fishing. He's having a good time. But this is one of the funnest videos that I've filmed in a long, long time. This is what makes me happy. And the fact that I was able to do it with Brandon is freaking awesome. Dude. We're definitely going to be teaming up more in the next few days. We got some really cool stuff planned. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you don't mind, leave it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it and you want to see us come out here and do it again, we'll make sure we amp it up. We're doing it again. We got to do it again. We got the, the catfish hole marked yes. on the graph. Hole so, five and six are hot. Maybe we even do it at some other locations, but bring some other people out here to, for, to let them experience for the first time. That was one of the first times I've ever done it, and it was awesome. I had a blast. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new, but that's pretty much it. We love you guys, and as always, boop.